played with my mic vol uh, my mic settings a little bit. First stream after I got my mic on, it was too quiet and the game was too loud. Then the last stream, my mic was too loud. So hopefully this time it's in a little bit of a better spot. Uh, actually, I want to go this way first. Gee, I wonder what item I get this dungeon. Forget something because Huh. There's a thing that's supposed to go oh I I did I sh should have done this part after. I was supposed to go right first. I need a key. That's where I get the statue. I'm all right. I found a new site to watch Stargate on that's in good quality. So I spent a couple hours watching that. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm trying to do this every day until the game's finished, uh, because I wanna get to get the, get the game done before I my trip. It's a quick game to play through if you know what to do, so. What happened to these guys? Okay. 
They get hit by the blast. Seems like a bit of a delay there. And it's just jars in there. Okay. So really all that's in here is the map. Here is the map. Nice. There's a little seam there in the water. I'm not ready for that yet. I have to go here. That was a very risky move. Good jumping. Fuck. Chance to get things lined up anyways. This room. Hi, Hugo. I just got past the worst room in the dungeon.
Make it, make it, make it. The water's gonna drop just as I get to it. Watch. Oh! Oh! All right, no more having to deal with water levels. There's a very important chest in this room. Fuck off, rat. button. Yep. Oh yeah. Number two. Salty seawater co sea water coating is kind of gross. I'll be waiting for you on Tingle Island. All of the Tingle statues have something gross, smelly, or sticky about them. And that's what makes them special. Soup. I'm low on magic and health, so I might as well <coughs> not let my fairy take care of it. Yep. 
One of the few instances of Link actually speaking, and you, the player, being able to hear it. Shoes are so annoying. Go, 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 go. Okay, I'm done. I said this in the last stream, but I'd love it if there was a dolphin code that made it so you could spawn a commandable Makar or Medley anywhere and have all of their um, flight controls and everything. Just explore sections of the game you're not supposed to get to. You can actually break these guys' armor if you hit it enough times without cutting the back. Oh, 
Oh yeah, these guys know martial arts and shit. Even if you take their weapon, they're not out of options. I'll just throw it at his face. Sometimes you can get rupees out of these, big piles of them. Doesn't look like any of the pillars in this room do it, though. I guess only in those combat shrines. Now that I have the bow, I can go back to that other room across from here where I got the command melody from, but um, that room with the eye switch, that's just a treasure chart, I believe. piece of heart at the start of the dungeon I can get with the bow, too. Not really worth the backtracking. fast. I'm definitely gonna hit up all the fairy fountains that I can tonight after this dungeon. <clears throat> ah. Well, I got a key anyways. This room was worth it. It's junk I can sell anyways, that'll come in handy later. Oh, th you know what, I could give... There is a uh, treasure item you can get from Windfall with the joy pendants I'm probably gonna get. Um, it it's a hero's charm. You wear it and it makes you can see enemy health bars.
that was supposed to work. Good thing I made it that time. Also, not the best timing, Blood Angel. Uh, saying Link doesn't say a single word. <laughs> Seconds after you post that. robes. Getting to the final stretch of the tower. Pretty sure I have to. Oh no, I don't have to kill it. I could try though. Hang on. This block it. Shit. Fuck. Now I'm in a bad spot. and I could kill it and they made them too quick the fact that you can't shoot them until they're active too it makes us like a real pain luckily this dungeon is the only time you ever encounter BMOs at least in this game Oh.
least the blue BMOs don't rotate. Oh good, I needed arrows. Bombs and arrows. Boss time. Quicker dungeon than I remember. You have done well to find your way to this place. Or chosen one. Accept this final challenge. Nintendo has a serious hand fetish. up all my arrows so they dropped more. Kind of a lame boss. Path can now be opened. Oh, chosen one. Wait, uh, what will now come to pass is tied to your fate. To path that, that go forward with caution. I mentioned this in the last stream, but I love how this Link isn't actually connected to the hero at all. Like, he is not a chosen one. At all. He's just some kid who woke up one day and got thrown into some adventure. He wasn't chosen to become the hero. Instead, he works to become worthy of being the hero.
And now that I've proven I'm worthy, it's time to claim my prize. You have done well, Link. It would seem the gods have acknowledged you to be a true hero. But this does not mean your trials have ended here. Once you have taken your first step into the world beyond the Ring of Light, you see shimmering in the waves before you. Your true trial will begin. Are you ready, Link? Gentlemen, it's been an honor playing with you tonight. So awesome. You are probably wondering where we are, aren't you? Unfortunately, there's not enough time for me to explain it to you now. Once you are able to strike down Ganon with the item you attain in this castle, all will be made clear to you. Trust in my words, see what awaits you in the castle. I can solve the Babby puzzle. <laughs> Link should kill them now in case they ever woke up. Zuwadu! Once I finish uh, watching Stargate with Alex, I should try to get him into JoJo. By the time uh, I finish Stargate, I think it'll be enough time that I can stand watching through all of JoJo again. Worth it to see parts 3 and 4 again.
Five was okay, but it wasn't really my favorite. Incredibly complicated puzzle. Who would have expected to be in the Triforce? <laughs> yeah. Excellent, Link. To perceive such a puzzle and decipher it is no subtle feat. You are not very bright, are you, King? Now take the sword that lies before you. It is none other than the Master Sword, the Blade of Evil's Bane. It is the only sword that can banish Ganon from the world above. I do plan on taking a little look around the room here. I got some stuff I want to show. You got the Master Sword, the legendary blade with the power to repel evil, once wielded by the legendary hero himself. Let's take a look at these murals. We got Rudo, Raru, Saria, Nando. Darunia, Impa, and Aburu. Seems to be implied that Naburu is topless and her hair is covering. <laughs> That's always the impression I got anyways. Gerudu Bobs. Uh, it does, does, it may not be at its full power right now, but it still does twice the damage than the last sword did. And that's why they throw all these enemies at you here. It's like, hey, look at how much stronger you are. Well, really, I just see it as an opportunity to get more, uh, knight's belts. I'm gonna focus on killing the pig boys first. Moblins die so much faster. And everybody completely forgot about me over there. Just <laughs> shoot him in the face. Yeah. 
there we go. God damn. still have another fairy and the other half of my soup, so things get too hairy. Cock. Well, there goes the fairy. Eight crests now, the, uh, the belt. Two more and I'll be able to get the hurricane spin. Might be able to get them both here. I know there's more enemies upstairs, there should be two. Confident dart nut. Please let there be one more night. Yes! Okay, good. Oh, it's one I already debelted, though. Oh, no, it's not! I got his armor, but not his belt. Alright.
Hyrule Field. It's blocked off, though. I know some glitches to actually get out of bounds and explore the field. In the final stream, I'll play around with that a bit. guys look a little lot very familiar story stuff's out of the way. I tend to do some exploring. Oh, wait a minute. I don't have that yet. That is the next stop. It's a heck of an arm you got there. And what an eye. No one's ever been able to spot me in there before now. You obviously have some mastery of the air. And now that we've established you're quite the wind waker, let's see if you can handle this. of a wind waker like you, my adorable little cyclones will be as happy as can be. If you need to move like the wind over the ocean deeps, just call on my cyclones. Well, I guess I'll head for home, home for now. See you on the down road.
Uh, Link, you're all right. Why did you not tell me about Arrow? That was thoughtless of you. This island has seen hard times ever since you departed. I do not know what have been going, what you have been doing on your journey, but you seem a little more daring these days. That look in your eyes is not the one you left here with. Very good. Show me just how much you've improved your sword skills. Oh, it's this shit. Enough! Ah, 101 blows, you have improved. I guess it was wrong of me to treat you like you are still a lowly page. You are a page no more. Now, you are a knight. Knight, it is not much, but it is now yours. Take this with you. The more you do this, uh, the more hits he asks you to do, and eventually he'll give you, he'll give you more rupees as you go up. And uh, eventually a piece of heart, but I'm not gonna do that, it's tedious. I'm just gonna get my heart case spin. Oh. Wait, that, that's a knight's crest. How many of these do you have? <clears throat> I suppose the time has come for me to speak to you about the crests. The knight's crest is a symbol of a courageous knight. But not just anyone can gather them, no. It takes a soul who possesses not only power, but wisdom and courage as well. Any courageous soul who gathers ten of these crests can learn a powerful new sword technique. Both my brother and I dreamt of learning this technique in our youth, who worked so hard to collect the crests. It took so many long years and adventures beyond count before we even apprehended, approached finding ten of them, and we both grew old. It appears you have enough might to er learn the technique now. Perhaps, just perhaps you could master it. Very good, Link. Heed my thought, heed my words. The ancient art of holding your arm out straight and just spoon! Amazing, Link. You did it. You mastered the hurricane spin. At last, you have made your long, our long-held dream a reality. Oh, the joyful tears. They won't stop. I thought my tears had dried up long ago. There is nothing left for me to teach you. I am certain now that you will save your sister, Errol, and bring her home to Outset. Boop! While I'm here, I should get a refill on my soup. Thank you. 
I have a little bit of business on Dragon Roost to take care of. I was expecting a big circle of electric ones to come down. Some of them do that. <laughs> I just killed these guys in two hits now. Not even two hits. Oh, I'm charged up on Elixir right now, so I do double damage. Before I hunt down some fairy fountains, I just have one quick dungeon detour to make here. I could do this off stream, but it's important that you guys see every single second of it. They thought about the position of this one 
and put it in a spot where you don't have to go too deep into the dungeon when you backtrack for it. Wait a minute, that's not the... Oh, this is a treasure chart. I'm remembering the spot wrong. It's over by the... Central room here. We have to go down there. That's right. Okay, it's still not too far, though. It's down there. Oh, der. I could have aimed for this and it would have been a quicker trip. There we go. There it is. Yep. Link's hat is very excited right now. It should be. This is a happy day. It bubbles over with warmth. It'll be waiting for you to- Oh, this one isn't all stinky. Okay, it's the one Tingle statue that isn't stinky. I was hoping I would get a little more height than that. Yeah. I should start grappling these guys more so I can get their I have 10 so far, and I think I need like 40 or 50 to get the hero charm. That's something I'm probably gonna farm off stream, too. Getting it naturally can take a while. Fairy time. I think it's that one. I don't think I've done that one yet. God damn it. Oh, what am I doing? I'm trying to bring up my C chart, but this is the Wii U. I can just look down. Yeah, I think that's the Northern Fairy Isle. I haven't done that one yet. the island go? 
Oh, I am close to Okay, Tower of the Gods was just blocking my view of it. Oh, there we go. I was wondering where you were. Best bomb bag. Oh, wait a minute, you know what? Let's open my C charts. Where is it? I have to visit Tingle to get it. I don't have it yet. There's a chart that he gives you that Shows where all the fairy fountains are. I should do the big Octo Fairy too. I think that's like east of the cabana. They're perfect. <laughs> the hell is this tower? Oh, Mr. Fairy, I've been longing to see you, sir. What should we play? What do you want to play? But you're not here to play? Next time, bring me one of your favorites. My favorites, a chart. I haven't seen yet. Please, sir, just bring me one, please. Goodbye, Mr. Fairy. Please come visit me here at Tingle Tower again, where wonderful fairy magic makes the place spin and spin. Also, slave labor. Yep. Yep. 
One of those guys is Tingle's brother. And the other is just some dude who washed up here. <laughs> and he, he just woke up on the beach dressed as a Tingle. And they put him to work. <laughs> oh, wow, that didn't take long. I went to get out in the, um... Mailbox is already shaking. That didn't take long at all. I talked to him and immediately he sent the letter. How are you doing? Like, Oh, it's from Granny. Nobody cares, Grandma. <laughs> as far as you know, the Tingle Brothers have only been in one other game. I might do the Tingle game someday. It seems only... natural that I should. There's another fairy island. And I was just coming over here for Beetle. I think this is one of the bottle locations. I want the bottle. Stingy bastard. I like that they added this thing to help you uh, aim with the cannon. The original uh, version of this game didn't have that. And it made aiming kind of a pain.
This might be the fairy island I can't do yet. Going by how close it is to Forsaken Fortress, this might be the one that requires the hammer. Uh, that looks like a fire ring. Yep. Yeah, I can't do this one yet. Unless... It's an eye switch. It's a hammer. There's some, be some fun to be had over there. I could have swore this was where... a minigame was. That might be it over there. Okay, gamepad had a little fart there. the fairy island over there. I think this is what I was looking for too, over here. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Cool. I guess no blue chew on this island. Oh, wow. Random ghost ship sighting. This man is asleep, and he has no idea the hell that's going on behind him. No, you can't board it until you get the sh uh, the chart for it. I usually never spot it until I seek it out. I never get random sightings like that. Very rare for me. Ah! Oh, never mind my mistake. Yeah, yeah, step right up. Confidence hub. Yeah, let's get through this. 50 rupees a game. God damn, dude. I am really fucking good at this minigame. Just 
They'll know, huh? Streamer's curse. I say I'm good and I'm gonna play it poorly. I have to get these two next two shots perfectly. <sighs> oh, ho, 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 shit. shooting but we won't hand over our priceless treasure so easily yeah miss hey miss Conzo, <laughs> you're at least an honorary member of my family are you not slacked like it don't lose your head you're a talented little kid i like you as we promised here's our treasure it's yours so take it yeah this guy's a fucking fruit loop If I do it again, I can get a C chart. But I ain't fucking with that. This fairy fountain's open. It might be rupees. Bigger wallet. Too, I can put a fairy in that. 5,000 rupee cap. Okay, I'm gonna take a peek at something real quick. I wanna double check the location of something. This will come in handy. Oh, it's east of outset, not the. I had a feeling, I wanted to make sure.
over here and just head south. gonna be around this reef somewhere. Actually, that's a good way to fight it. There, that flock of seagulls. Arrows might be better. Maybe not. Waker of the winds. Thanks to you, I have been freed from that beast's foul grasp. As thanks, I shall give you just a little of my power. <clears throat> Double magic. <clears throat> place where the wind god guides you. You will find one who can grant new power to the hero's bow that you wield. Power that can freeze uh, uh, fierce flames and melt the coldest ice. If you find you have need of such power, you must call upon the powers of the god wind, wind god. The winds of fortune always blow across your bow. Yeah, I don't think I can do that yet. I think I have to clear Forsaken Fortress. Speaking of, uh, speaking of, I think I should do that now, and then I'll call it a night. Sounded like he hit me, but it didn't damage me. That, by the way, is officially listed as a Gjorg. Like the uh, fish boss from Majora's Mask. This game also has, um, wall masters, 
or floor masters, I mean. But, um, what bugs me about them is their design is more like the, uh, Dexy hands from Majora's Mask. Those blue hands that are in, like, a couple spots. Some chunky frame rates. There it is. Oh. Oh, well, good enough. Ganon has likely been made aware of your little incursion already. But you have the Master Sword. That sword shall shine in the darkness, casting back evil. With it in your hands, none can keep you from rescuing your sister. Do not be afraid. you to see me now, you fuckers. Tingle and Ganon share a voice actor. I just feel like I should point that out again. This particular Ganon, I should say. And this particular Tingle. He's also the Japanese voice of Big the Cat, along with Donkey Kong's voice actor. <laughs> Sounds like he voices all the quality characters. I could kill them so much faster if I used the damn sword, but... What's the fun in that? <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, okay. I I know I know that. Uh... Oh, that's right. That's right. I I had it in my mind that um, Wind Waker Ganon and Twilight Princess Ganon were the same voice actor, but Wind Waker is Ocarina of Time Ganon's voice actor. I, I always mix that up because Wind Waker's Ganon sounds so much like TP with the gruffness. Getting my revenge on these moblins. place is so much quicker to get through once you don't have to worry about stealth. Just run up and kill shit. They did that on purpose, for sure. Like, this is your victory lap now. There's a ladder here. Well, if there's anything Game Grumps taught me, it's if at first something doesn't work, keep doing it like a fucking idiot. <laughs> alright, alright, I'm gonna change the wind. I'm gonna stop being lazy. Or I could just sidle across, like you're supposed to. I was using the leaf because of that light. I'm probably going to get bombed. Nice. I'm gonna want to slow down the footage there and what happened. Something real weird happened at Miniblin when I hit the button. He, like, he went into another dimension. Big brother. You're okay. I, I was worried. Hi. The cell won't open that easily. There you go, acting before you think, as usual. I swear, do you even realize that we had to draw that monster bird off for you? It was about to come flying in here after you again. That sword. 
You know, funny thing about this scene, when the pirates carry the girls out, I was fucking around with Game Shark codes some time back. If you go from the very start of the game on Outset straight to here and do this cutscene, the pirates aren't there and the girls just get floated away. Where did you get that? Are you... Is that even possible? How could it be? Hmm. Well, never mind about that. For now, we'll just take these girls. I'm sure their fathers back in town will pay a handsome reward for their return. I guess because they're still on outset and the game doesn't know how to respond. <laughs> Strange. You'd think they would just use them in the cutscene. I'm so sorry to interrupt such a heartwarming reunion. But isn't there still something you need to take care of? If you're worried about your sister, don't be. I promise, I'll deliver her safely back to your little island. Normally I'd expect a huge reward for something like this, but this time it's my treat. Listen, Errol, your brother still has some things to take care of. Big, important, grown-up things. He'll be back soon, so you just wait nice and quiet until he returns, okay? B big brother. It's Tetra. We have to hurry. The bird will be here any second. Gonzo, excellent. You're just in time. Take this one for me. But she's... She's fine. Just do as you're told. Big brother! Link. We'll be back, I swear it. She wants the D. Fucking payback time. This was so cathartic as a kid killing this bird. Cobblins dying behind me. how long they've been waiting inside those jars. That's a good thought. And the mist from, like, the ocean. Like, we're in the ocean. Like, those surely get filled up with, like, water. Like, condensation and shit. They probably got, like, mold and, like, cheese growing on their, like, taints. It's a good thing uh, Ganon left this tool here. The, the one tool to defeat his bird minion, and he just kind of had it laying around in his fortress. It wasn't here the last time I was here. He just decided to add it. It's like, you know what would be great? A hammer. Just in a... Just a 
random box. In the original, these shrapnel pieces would block your sword, and it was really annoying, because like the first time you break his helmet off, you couldn't really get any hits in because of it. Vinny got an amazing kill on this fucker when he streamed it. He killed him with the bow and arrow, like as he was flying around. He just got like a random shot in. I don't know how the hell Vinny did that. It was in his randomizer run. Oh! 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 Double shot! And <laughs> it killed him! Oh, that gyro aim is amazing. I love it. Alright, my cat's being a pecker. He wants to get butt out. One second. Come on. Getting to my favorite cutscene in the game. When I, was a, I, I fucking love this cutscene as a kid. I never knew you could do that until Vinny's run where he did that. It's been a while, boy. You've done well to sneak into my fortress and wriggle your way all the way up here. I suppose the least I can do is commend you for your reckless courage. My name is Ganondorf, and I am the master of the Forsaken Fortress. By the way, boy, when you drew that sword of yours out of its pedestal, did you by chance notice how all of the monsters frozen in time down there suddenly began stirring again? Do you understand precisely what that means? I highly doubt you do. Foolish child, while that sword is indeed the blade of evil's bane, at the same time, it has long played another role. You see, it is also a sort of key. A most wretched little key that has kept the seal on me and my magic intact. By withdrawing the blade, you have broken the seal.
You cannot defeat me with a blade that does not sparkle with the power to repel evil. What you hold is useless. Go back to the world below and tell that to the pathetic fools who made this blade. Its, its power is gone, and its edges are dull. Link, get up! Stop. Let, let me go. You pathetic little sea rat. Whoa, you suddenly have a necklace. Holy shit. My triforce of power is resonating. <laughs> At long last, I found you. Princess Zelda. W what? What are you talking about? I don't know any Zelda. Feigning ignorance will gain you nothing. Tell me, if you are not Zelda, then why do you have this fragment of the Triforce? That was his plan. He was about to, but Tetra intervened. Ganondorf voice really did a number on my throat, I gotta say. <clears throat> it's alright, Link. She's merely lost consciousness. Your sister has escaped from the forsaken fortress of the pirates. You can relax. She's safe now. Lord Velu, you arrived not a moment too soon. We are deeply grateful. I am aware of this. Yet I thought of our I thought our first priority should be to separate these two from Geddon's grasp. As if it would do anything. What, Tetra intervening? I mean it did by late time, he would have been killed. It bought time for the Rito to come in and save our asses. Oh, burning the place? It pisses him off. He doesn't have a base now. Link, I'll explain things later. Now we must return to the world beneath the sea. That's actually what Valu was saying in Hylian there. He was talking about how, while I did a number in his fortress, this will not do much to hinder him. Oh, ow. Link, you're all right? What is this place? Hey, and Ganondorf, what happened to him? Hey. Link, what are you doing? You must come now to the room where you got the Master Sword. Who's using that stone? Hey, just who are you? Link and I are the only ones who can speak through this stone. How dare you use what's not yours? Your name is Tetra, correct? You must come with Link to see me at once. Huh. Well, don't you sound important. Fine. We're on our way. Just hold your horses, whoever you are. Link, what are you waiting for? You are the stone? You're supposed to show me how to get to where that voice is. You all right, Tetra? I think she got a bit of brain damage when Ganondorf hit her. Ah! 
Well, it's not too much of a spoiler, Hugo, since we're about to get some answers on that. <clears throat> Are you him? Are you the one who was speaking through my stone without my permission? Answer me. That stone is an enhanced version of the Gossip Stones, long spoken of in the legends of Hyrulean royal family. I am the one who made it. <laughs> you made it? The royal family's Gossip Stone? I'm sorry, but I have no idea what you're talking about. Have neither of you heard of the tales? Tales of the kingdom spoken of in the legend of the great hero. The place where the power of the gods lies hidden. This place... Where the two of you now stand is that kingdom. This is Hyrule. And I am its king, Daphnis Nohansen Hyrule. <laughs> Link, do you not recognize my voice? Indeed, I am the one who guided you here. I am the king of red lions. There was no need for me to reveal my true identity to you. So long as that blade, the Master Sword, could defeat Ganon. But now, both of you must listen to me. Once long ago, this land of Hyrule was turned into a world of shadows by Ganon, who sought to obtain the power of the gods for his own evil ends. My power alone could not stop the fiend, and our only choice was to leave the fate of the kingdom in the hands of the gods. When the gods heard our pleas, they chose to seal away not only Ganon, but Hyrule itself, and so were the torrential downpour of raids from the heavens. Our fate, our fair kingdom was soon buried beneath the waves, forgotten at the bottom of the sea. Yet all was not lost, for the gods knew that to seal the people away with the kingdom would be to grant Ganon's wish for the destruction of the land. So before the sealing of the kingdom, the gods chose those who would build a new country and commanded them to take refuge on the mountaintops. Those people were your ancestors. Hundreds of years have passed since then. So long as Ganondorf was not revived, Hyrule would remain below, never walking, waking from its slumber. Tetra, come to me. Well, he talks through the Gossip Stone. It's implied that he has one, Hugo. The necklace you wear is part of the sacred treasure called the Triforce of Wisdom, which has been passed down for many ages with the royal, within the royal family of Hyrule. It could also just be that he's using Hyrulean magic, because... I mean, he's also commanding a boat. Your mother passed this down to you and instructed you to treasure it and to guard it with your life. Am I not correct? The Triforce of Wisdom is none other than the sacred power of the gods that we have kept from Ganon's clutches for so many long years. The gods placed upon your ancestors the task of protecting it from evil's grasp. You too must abide by the laws of the past, and so, the time has come for me to teach you the fate into which you were born, the very reason that you live. Oh, we're doing this twist again. Okay. I guess I'm a princess. My, my fate. You are the true heir of the royal family of Hyrule and the last link in the bloodline. You are Princess Zelda. Zelda? I'm a princess? You are confused, aren't you? I suppose such is to be expected. Link, I'm terribly sorry that you've been caught up in these events. 
Now that it is known for... Oh, I thought it was Zelda talking. But now that it is known that Tetra is indeed Princess Zelda, Ganon will be searching frantically for this child in an attempt to get the power of the gods that she possesses. He will not rest until he has found her. If he succeeds, my ancient kingdom under the sea will be turned into a land of shadow and despair, and so will the world you know above the waves. Link, I need you to lend me your strength in this dark hour. I have a suspicion about what has caused the Master Sword to lose its power. I need for you to come with me back to the lands above the water and return to the power, power to the Master Sword. Zelda. It is far too dangerous for you to join us in this task. You're going to get kidnapped while we're gone. Fortunately, the sacred chamber is not yet known to Ganon. It is my wish that you'd wait here in hiding until he returns. We return. Link, we must go. Look, there is a spot underneath Grandma's house she can hide. Ganon would never think to look there. Link. I don't know how to say this. Everything that's happened to you and your poor sister, it's all been my fault. I'm so sorry. Link. Be careful. Yeah, I can also put her where I found the Picto box. Just a random back passage in a jail cell. Ganondorf might try looking there, but he's just gonna rage quit because he's gonna keep bumping into the rats and getting tossed out. <laughs> There you go, yeah, you can't fit. I feel like regardless of if he can fit or not, he would still try. He'd just like try cramming his head in there. Blink, listen well. The fact that the Master Sword lost its power to repel evil suggests to me that something has happened to the Sages who infused the blade with the God's power. The Sages should be here in Hyrule, in the Wind Temple to the north and the Earth Temple to the south, praying to the Gods. You must head for these two temples to see what has happened to the Sages and attempt to find a way to recover the power to repel evil. Unfortunately, Ganon seems to have eradicated, erected some sort of magical barrier down here in Hyrule blocking our path to the temples. But each temple should have another entrance high upon Hyrule's mountaintops, which are now islands above the sea. As always, I shall mark these places on your sea chart. Now then, if we stay here much longer, we shall draw enemies' attention to Princess Zelda's whereabouts. We must return to the surface immediately. Now, the idea of there being two entrances, like he just said, Makes me wish that there was a, um, place in each dungeon where you can exit to, like, a part of Hyrule Field. And, like, find little secrets and stuff. That would have been kind of cool. Link, do you know the legend of the Hero of Time? Once long ago, he defeated Ganon and brought peace to the Kingdom of Hyrule. A piece of the Triforce was given to the Hero of Time, and he kept it safe, much as Zelda kept hers. That sacred piece is known as the Triforce of Courage. When the Hero of Time was called to embark on another journey and left the land of Hyrule, he was separated from the elements that made him a hero. It is said that at that time, the Triforce of Courage was split into eight shards and hid throughout the land. Even I do not know where they rest, but this much I do know. They lie hidden somewhere in this great sea. Might you have crossed paths with someone who knows much about things that lie hidden in the depths of the sea? Well, fret not, if you can think of not one, no one, 
Though maybe you would come upon knowledge by asking around in a place where many people gather. That's not how they made the Master Sword you learned. I wonder if they were making Skyward Sword as they just forgot this whole thing about the sages giving the Master Sword the power to seal evil. Because that's not what happens at all. Yeah, this inconsistency is all throughout the series. Like, how come Link didn't get sealed away when he drew the Master Sword in this game? He's a child. In Ocarina of Time, Link got sealed away for seven years because uh, the, the gods deemed that he was not old enough to be the hero. This one, he just pulls it and it's like... Well... This is a hard game to put down. I'm tempted to do more exploring, but I haven't gone for about two and a half hours now. I could at least do this. I should be able to do it now. Yep, I can do it now. Cool. <laughs> Tell me, little boy, can you control the wind? Hehe, <laughs> so young, to have such power. How did you know to find me here? I am the queen of the fairy world. What is the matter, my child? Does that not surprise you, young one? I like you. And so, I shall give you a new power to the bow that you wield. Yes, people actually did compare that, Hugo. That was among the um, theories. That the that, that people thought that Fee was the queen of the fairies and that she was going to play an integral role or something. <laughs> I think that was like one theory I saw. Ice arrows can freeze the hottest flames, and fire arrows can melt the coldest ice. The fairies in this fountain will ease your weariness. Use them as you need to. Child, I must tell you, you're just my type. <laughs> I love the way the king looks at him. He's like, yeah, you're gonna hit that, aren't you? <laughs> Link and the King are just a couple of bros in this game. I can just picture Link and the King just lounging out at the beach. Staring at Tingle's bikini as he walks by. Alright, I got mail and then no more uh, stalling. <laughs> That's the 
cash on delivery one. Oh, it's this. I can't bring this up on the screen for you guys to see. Okay, so this is one of the things they did to streamline this game. One, two, three. Five of the Triforce shards are just Triforce shards. You don't have to deal with any chart for them. So I only have to do three charts. So that makes things a lot quicker. Yeah, before you had to do all eight, and it was super fucking expensive. Alright, alright. Oh, yeah, uh... So... There's Triforce charts, eight of them in the original that you would find and you had to pay Tangle like 365 rupees each one to have them deciphered and once they're deciphered you could use them to find where uh, Triforce shards are buried in the ocean and it got pretty fucking expensive it didn't help that the wallets were smaller so you couldn't even hold as much money It was, uh, it was pretty bad. Okay. I had my fun. Uh, tomorrow I'm gonna aim to do the wind and earth temples, and then the stream after that, this will probably be done. Alright, later.